Life is good all this month at Appalachian Wireless. Get the LG G5 for just one penny with sign-up or renewal of a two-year service agreement. That's almost $100 off the regular price. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. The Pike Fiscal Court has already approved establishing a broadband board for the county. Now, Deputy Judge Executive Brian Morris wants to get that board populated and working toward bringing broadband access to the county. At today's fiscal court meeting, Morris said the county cannot wait any longer to begin working toward widespread broadband access without risking falling behind. That's why I think Pike County needs to own the infrastructure to the broadband. Two, we need find a contractor to come in that can service, maintain, and give us oversight on broadband. And three, the, the board needs to award a retailer to provide the service to the county. Morris told the members of the Pike Fiscal Court that it's time the county starts working towards spreading broadband access across the county. He said the 60 jobs created through Teleworks, located at Ford Mountain at Mita, are examples of how broadband access can help create jobs. Morris also said the city of Pikeville has been a model for providing broadband access and it's time for the county to act. The city of Pikeville is setting the standards in the Commonwealth on broadband. Not only do they got their board together, they've already got their funding in place to provide broadband within the city limits. I believe strongly if Pike County doesn't get on board, not only will surrounding counties not only will the state pass the by, surrounding counties will pass this by on its broadband. Morris wants the court to begin populating its broadband board and let it get to work bringing broadband access to the county and with it, economic development. Teleworks is a prime example. Seven months ago it wasn't even in Pike County. By bringing broadband to one location, generating over 60 jobs at 11.50 an hour, you know, let's bring the infrastructure that we can bring to Pike County and, and, and let's, let's get ahead of the curve. The court took no action on the issue at Tuesday's meeting, but Morris said he plans to continue bringing the issue up for discussion over the coming months. At the Pike County Courthouse, Chris Anderson, EKB News.